soccer's number one pin-up and biggest earner holds the dubious honour of being the first England captain ever to be sent off. On a brighter note, he's also the first England player ever to have scored in three World Cup competitions, before being unceremoniously dumped from the side in July 2006. After captaining his country through 50 international matches, he was philosophical about being left out of the squad. Um, yeah, it was hard at the time, I must admit, but um, you know, I think I've been through ups and downs in my career and I think it's, you know, I've had disappointments and this is a disappointment. It, it's, uh, of course, um, upset me to a certain extent, but, you know, uh, there's, there's other things in life and there's more important things uh, that, that go on in the world and you have to get over disappointment. Disappointments he's had to overcome have included being hounded by tabloids after his former personal assistant Rebecca Luz claimed he'd been playing away from home in more ways than one during his stint with Real Madrid. Despite rumours of a split from wife Victoria, the celebrity pairing that began in 1997 and became known as Posh and Bex stayed firm. His image has been used to sell shoes, razors, milk, soft drink, chocolate, cosmetics and mobile phones. He's even launched his own scent. But he still makes time to put back into the game. As well as fathering three potential football stars of the future, he's opened academies for kids around the world. I've always said that that would be nice, it would be great to find future stars, but at the end of the day that's not what the academy is about. It's about achieving something for kids to come down and have fun and have the ability to learn about the sport, about football, um, learn about healthy eating, learn about you know different parts of the body, different injuries and things like that. But nothing lasts forever, and with David's serious football career nearing the end of its natural life, Something had to be done to secure the future of their extravagant lifestyle. Since Victoria started hobnobbing with the likes of Katie Holmes and Jennifer Lopez, it made sense to consider a move stateside. Beck's five-year contract with LA Galaxy stands to earn him a tidy 50 million a year. Enough to ensure that Posh lives up to her nickname long after he's hung up his boots. <laughs>